Hey everybody, beautiful day. Gonna do some product reviews here. People ask me a lot about what happens if I break my fingernail. Well, that's actually just fine. That's not even that short. But <clears throat> when I break a fingernail, it's a tough decision. Um, two different things I've used in the past. First is the Joel Hooks Thimble. And this is brass. So that gives an interesting sound and I'll, um, I'll give you links to this stuff down below. But, um, and you get to hear it too. But the second is the Fred Kelly Freedom Pick. And this is like a, a molded plastic, uh, but it's much more durable than regular plastic. Um, it's not gonna just break, but uh, this fits like that. So yeah, let's hear them. First off, let's play without them a little bit so you can hear that and compare. Let's try this uh, brass Joel Hooks thimble. Try this Fred Kelly pick. Okay, um, first impressions are that anytime you want to wear a pick, it's going to be different. Everything about playing that banjo is going to be different once you put a foreign object onto your finger. Um, so it is definitely something you have to get used to and you have to practice with. So if you have trouble with nails breaking or anything like that, I suggest you practice regularly with one of these devices on, one of these picks, so that when you break that nail, it's no big deal. You can just rock on, keep playing. Uh, also, after just playing it for just a few minutes, this brass one seems to be harder to get used to. Again, not saying that's good or bad. Whereas this Fred Kelly seems pretty much plug and play. I don't have to change the angle of my attack on the strings quite as much with this one. I do have to change it some though, so be prepared for that. Um, you know, this is not an extension of your hand. <laughs> um, it's a foreign thing. You can't feel like you feel with your fingers and your fingernail. So it's something to get used to. Wanted to give you all a quick note about product reviews. I've been playing banjo quite a while since uh, about 2003. So I've tried a whole bunch of different products out. Since I have a lot of those products, I'll probably just review them like I did the strings and things like that. Currently, I don't have any affiliations with anybody, but if I ever do, I'll let you know in that video if I do. Um, but yeah, I'm just giving you some, I'm just giving you my personal opinion from 15 years of playing the banjo. So, you know, of course someone else may have different opinions and use different things, but I thought you might appreciate that. Um, so yeah, I'll be bringing you some of these product reviews, um, just for fun. And, uh,
now that I've got that iPad stand that you saw in that picture, thanks to my supporters, um, now that I got that, we're going to have off the porch session videos. Boom! So yeah, we can go off the porch now. Uh, thanks for coming along and, uh, you know, joining Banjo Lemonade and I hope you've uh, enjoyed the ride so far and we're going to go lots of places. Um, Y'all have a great day and remember, Jesus loves you.